Hello, Beret Troop. Welcome back. I'm the real Andy of Beret Hills, and welcome to another piece of tea of the day, girl. Tea on the go because I am driving, and you know, you know the deal. If I'm not looking at the camera, it's because a bitch is trying not to die. I hope that you guys are having an amazing day, and it is time to talk about the real housewife of Beret Hills because last night we had the conclusion the ending to chapter 13 of the real house with a very hills <clears throat> girl everyone and their moms are talking about kathy hilton girl i am just in awe of kathy hilton to be very honest i'm thinking that i still do not understand the actual reason of why they brought her into the reunion you know just because she was not part of the season at all you know look i don't need an excuse to have more kathy hilton on my tv because if it was up to me she will be even holding like a diamond right but i i do have to understand from the viewer's point of view that it doesn't make a lot of sense you know that she was there while someone like denise richards who actually have a storyline, a little storyline, you know, with Erica was not invited to the reunion. But anyways, the point is that she was there and everyone was shaking. They were physically shaking, you know, and it's just so funny. Look, Kathy Hilton commands respect. Kathy Hilton is, you know, right here. The fact that we only got a third part of the reunion because of Kathy Hilton, it should show you who is the queen of Beverly Hills, you know, like a real queen, because this is just her living her life, you know, like she literally, she doesn't need the coins, she doesn't need the fame, she doesn't need anything, you know, she's just there to support Kyle Richards. Now, there is a lot of talk because Kathy Hilton, you know, I mean, she comes, she... Uh, just her mere presence sent Sutton Strack to the hospital. Well, that's what they, that's what the streets are saying. Look, I'm not gonna shade Sutton because I actually do love Sutton. You know, uh, you know that I, I root for her so much. Um, I believe that if she is um, what what is hypertense, I think is the word. If she if she if she suffers from blood pressure or any of that it's it's a real condition you know and shit can happen you know and things like exhaustion and dehydration are real things that have happened before to many many people you know uh it's just of course the timing of everything so there are two things here if it was truth Sutton is probably right now kicking herself because, you know, it's going to be like, oh my God, this is what the world is going to think, that I just fake everything because Kathy Hilton was there, right? And it doesn't help that Kathy literally said like, oh, I was going to let her have it, uh, but this happened, you know? Um, also, another lesson that we need to learn is that no one, should be talking about Kathy Hilton about things that didn't happen on camera. Period. Period. Okay? Now, what Sutton said was not as bad as, as what Lisa Rena said because Lisa Rena definitely, like, took it to a whole other level, right? But still, she kind of, like, give the implications, you know, that Kathy Hilton scream at her and like lose her shit or something like that, right? But again, if this didn't happen on camera, why is being said? That's the only thing that I do have to call Sutton out a little bit. You know that over here, we, we keep it real. We, we, we love everyone, but if we have to call a bitch out, we will call a bitch out, you know? That's the only thing that I have to say to Sutton. Why did you have to say that on camera? Say it behind the camera so you can like then say, like, I never said that, you know, but on camera is going to be very complicated. And do you think that, that, Ka, that I'm sorry, that Kathy was going to be okay with you sharing something like that? 
I don't know. Just put it in out there, you know. Uh, I feel that there is something about loyalty, you know, especially in Berry Hills that is very important, right? And, and Sutton should know better. You know, she should have been like, especially when she took it to the point of like, you already lost two sisters. Do you want to lose a third? Girl. Girl. You know, like, it just, it, it was just a little bit too far, right? But I think she learned her lesson. And um, I think she's gonna know. Now, it is a little bit weird. Some people are calling it like a Lisa Vanderpump moment, like when Lisa Vanderpump faint on Dancing with the Stars to get all out of the show, you know? Um, I don't know, you know? I, I honestly don't know because I also have literally been present uh, on, on people who had this condition and who can literally faint and, and, and even worse things could happen out of this, you know? So I do believe that there, there is a possibility, you know, that she was in fact not feeling well, you know, that she was suffering from exhaustion and dehydration, you know? A lot of people are calling herself out for going with her when, you know, in Spain, no one went with Crystal to the hospital other than a producer. Well, what can I tell you, you know, like, um, I don't think Arcel is scared of Kathy Hilton. I don't think she has anything to be scared of Kathy Hilton, you know? So I don't think that's the reason. I do believe, I do genuinely think that Garcelle is a really, really good friend of Sutton and she was very worried. Maybe she was not as friends with Crystal in Spain, so she didn't give a shit about Crystal, you know? Which is sad, but you know, I know that they are in a better place now. But like, you know what I mean? So maybe, maybe something like that uh, was what happened. Now, the whole, I mean, Kathy Hilton being part of the reunion, it was literally just to be a support of Kyle, you know? Um, I feel that Kyle knew that she was going to be eviscerated, like Erica said, at the reunion. And she was like, I need support. I need someone there who is not going to let all of these girls talk or, or like, you know, uh, walk all over me. Which is weird because Kyle, usually she can stand her ground. But I don't know why when it comes to her marriage and this side of her personal side, life, you know, she gets so like weird, you know? I don't know if it's because of the Morgan Wade situation, the possibly being a lesbian, the fact that she didn't deny it, you know? Like the whole thing was just kind of like, like weird, you know? Uh, so I think that's why she asked Kathy to like be here and like be just just of support. Kathy Hilton didn't went to like rehash things, you know. She was literally there to yeah to double down on whatever Kyle was saying. So I believe that she probably. You know, she knew, she knew. And also, let's be honest, because it's not like Kathy woke up one day and she was like, oh, I wanna, I wanna go to the reunion. No, I th this has to be approved by Bravo, by everyone, you know. So, of course, Bravo is gonna know that bringing Kathy Hilton was going to bring the ratings extremely up, you know, that people were dying to watch Kathy Hilton. Now, people trying to, uh, there are a couple haters here and there, you know, trying to cancel Kathy Hilton over, you know, the comments of Sutton Strack, you know, and stuff like that. To be very honest with you, I do believe that, that if Kathy had anything to rehash this season, was that comment that Sutton did, you know? Was it as bad as Lisa's Renas? Again, no. And I do believe, I, I look, if this was fake, it was a very bad move by Sutton Strack because then she should she should just like stay and just deal with it. But this is the thing. That's why I don't believe this was fake. Is because Sutton, you know, she might be quirky and all of that, but she she could confront Kathy Hilton. I don't think she's afraid of Kathy Hilton. You know. I mean, Kathy Hilton is still, like, here, but I don't think she's, like, that afraid of Kathy Hilton, you know? And I think it could come from, like, a place of friendship and love eventually. But we, I think we, we will never know, 
is what I'm trying to say. We will honestly never know when, where is the truth, what really happened with Miss Sutton, you know? Um, but Kathy had the right, you know? I, I will be doing the same, you know? Like, you are coming here to the show doing the same bullshit that Lisa Reyna did last season, talking about shit that was not on camera. So the thing is, when you talk about things that were not on camera and there is no way to corroborate exactly what was said, then you can twist the words, you can change the narrative, and then, you know, people are going to believe whatever they want to believe. And it's a very dangerous game, you know? So, yes, Kathy had the right to be like, bitch, why did you say that, you know? Why would you weaponize my friendship, my sorry, my relationship with my sisters to, to go after Kyle? I think it's a, 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 it's a very valid point. You know what I mean? So, I believe, I, I look, I think that we're going to be watching Kathy back next season probably as a friend of the show and i think sutton needs to put on her big pants girl i said that super bad latino moment guys big girl pants you know <laughs> and, and 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 just talk to kathy because again it was not as bad at, as what Lisa Rena said, you know, maybe she could say like, hey, uh, I'm sorry that I used your name. This is this was actually between your sister and I and I should have never used your name. Period. Period. That's the whole apology. You don't have to say anything else, you know. Let's wait and see. Um, but I cannot hate on Satan because I do like her too much to hate on her. You know, I will. Oh, I, right now, you know that my dream team is Miss Crystal Minkoff, Miss Sutton Strack, and Miss Garcelle Boy Bay. You know, so that's like my my dream team. I'm. You know that I that I, that I cannot hate too much on Kyle because I have this love hate relationship with her, and in the the bottom of my heart, I will wish that Kyle will just jump to the light, you know, and, and join the cool group. Uh, but I don't think it's going to happen, you know. Now, one thing that I love that people were talking also was like, like the um, Kathy Hilton talking to Erica Jane. And I think people need to make no mistakes here, okay? I feel that we all know that Kathy Hilton hates Erica Jane. <laughs> you know? I mean, Erica Jane all like try to destroy her life with Lisa Rena. I mean that's that's a fact baby. That's we all know that. You know like that that was last season, right? But I feel that but you we all know and if you don't know I'm telling you that Kathy Hilton she is a lady. So when Erica who is sitting right there next to Erica I'm sorry. Erica who is sitting right there next to Kathy, you know, turns and say like so, how are you? How's it going? I was like, oh, Erica, no, you know. But Kathy's always going to be a lady. What do you think is going to happen? That she was going to be, don't talk to me, you fucking bitch? No, that's never going to happen, you know. She's just going to be a lady. She's just going to talk, you know. She's just going to, like, keep it classy, you know. But if you know, you know, okay? I think, like, like yes. Um, so that's what I'm thinking. Let's see. I'm, I, from what I'm hearing, you know, I think that everyone is going to be returning to the show, except from Anne-Marie, which, goodbye, you know, and, uh, let's, let's wait and see, you know, do I think that we need Erica Jane? No, I still don't get why she's still part of the show, but it is what it is, you know, that I make my peace with whoever comes back, I am not gonna, like, ruin my life because someone is on a reality show or not, you know what I mean? So anyways, uh, that was it. I mean, this is not like everything that happened at the ring. I just wanted to talk about all of these rumors going around related to Kathy Hilton and Sutton's track, you know, because it, it was a, a big thing, you know, and she and Sutton literally missed the whole segment with Kathy Hilton. And I feel that it wouldn't be so much more if she would have just like a stay, you know, like maybe go to the back room, drink some water, you know, and then come back. Um... But you know how these ladies, and this is not only Saturn. I feel like every single housewife is like this, you know. They they are like, oh, no, my pinky is in pain. I need to go to the emergency room because I must have, like, cancer of the nail. You know? So I'm like, girl. <laughs> but it is what it is. So let me know what you guys think in the comments below. What are your thoughts on Miss Kathy Hilton on the third part of the reunion? 
and the, the real in itself. Let me know, and if you wanna get all the tea related to The Real Housewife of Beverly Hills or any of the other Bravo shows, make sure to like this video, share this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and I'll see you around. See ya, bye.